update now. The former CEO of a Tulsa trucking company tells a judge he's guilty. Doug Peelsticker admitted to a $25.6 million conspiracy as well as lying on his taxes. Two News reporter Liz Bryant in federal court all day where Peelsticker revealed his part for the first time ever. Liz? Well, Russ, from 23 counts down to just these two, Doug Peel's sticker took a plea bargain with the U.S. Attorney's Office inside this federal courthouse this afternoon. I want to show you some video of him walking out a free man for now. Doug Peel's sticker revealed to the judge this. It's the first time we've heard from him. In late 2009, he became aware Aero Trucking Company was not paying payroll taxes to the IRS, but using that money for luxury items. But he did nothing to change it. Doug Peelsticker went on to say he didn't personally write false and inflated invoices to the bank, but become, became aware of that too and didn't correct it. Also in 2009, Peelsticker admitted Aero Trucking paid his personal expenses. Then he didn't report the wage on taxes. His attorney agreed to only answer my question after court. Glad today to be able for Doug to stand up and take responsibility for his part in what happened at Aero Trucking. Uh, but only his part and not the part of others. Uh, as the court made clear, Mr. Peelsticker was not the organizer or leader of the criminal activity that was going on at the time. So it is a very difficult thing, as you might imagine, to uh, tell your family these issues. Again, Peelsticker's attorney told the judge in no way was he the leader or organizer of the conspiracy that involved more than five people. He faces up to 10 years in prison and restitution of $51 million. Doug Peel sticker back inside this court in May for sentencing. Live right now, Liz Bryant, 2 News, works for you.